us black people are down here, we'll always remain here, but one thing we have to make sure is that we stand above that. We show this society that we are strong, because every time they bring out changes, it doesn't make us stay down the bottom, because we're always going to fight against these changes. That's what happened in 82. And at the same time in Sydney, we were protesting down out the front of Parliament House. And myself and about five other blackfellas here broke down the fence and we made it into Parliament. We got arrested, of course. Yeah, but the, the story's there, when we were arrested inside Parliament, we were flogged. I mean, they flogged the shit out of us, the police. You know, and what, I wrote a poem about it. One of, the, one of the police officers there said to myself and a, and a cousin of mine, he said, hey, look, this black fella's not breathing. Ah, oh, fuck him, we'll just throw him off the bridge. You know, these things we're still living, living with today. You know, the, the death in custody. If they want to change everything about our people, why don't they follow the recommendations that were first brought up in those, in those their death in custody policies? But they keep changing it to try and keep us down the bottom. And what we have to make sure is that we stand strong. It doesn't matter if there's not 50,000 people here. It only takes one black person to stand up and scream and shout. So let's destroy those. Hey, what what happened there? Well, oh, no, um, someone ran, ran over him. Oh, it was about this guy here. Um, no, he was just asking him. Um, if we seen this guy. We're asking you don't help. have some any questions without an adult. That's fine, we were just asking. Yeah, yeah well, awesome. keep your fucking mouth. Fair enough. Leave them alone. Exactly. Don't you know the law? You don't question two rest without an adult. Fuck all. And now they've got 25 to work with them. And then we've got this other plan down the Gold Coast to get one of the biggest parts. You know, if you know what's going to happen, they're going to be saying, hey, let's make all these black people work for the dolls for the money cup. If they don't, they'll cut them off the dolls. You know, I mean, this is a dangerous situation that we find ourselves in people. And everybody has to be aware of that. Right, so what I'm going to say is, stay strong, stay black, and stay proud. Yeah. And you know the coppers of cigar brass, they are when they used to buck the foot us in the in the watch us, suck the swear. Like you know, like they used to bear us and everything. But it's a rough friend they could have wear blue suits. But it's a rough friend to fuck the bloody hit us and that. When we try to fight her back, oh they're gonna be uh get big mob for us. I've been in women's prison and my sister girl here too. But it's the right for you to hit us and shit. And what? It's the right for you to talk down to us and when we talk up to you, like when we, um, what's it called? Um, when, when we talk up to you, disrespect you, you disrespect us, and we disrespect you back. And you don't like that then? You know? I don't give a fuck out, bloody. It's the right for you. I don't give a fuck out, bloody. Or you, copper, jump right in the head of it, can you know, but it's the right for you when you got blue suits, you know? You think it's like, you laugh about it, then, eh? Think it's all dark, eh? Okay? Think it's all mine because you're wearing blue. My sister, here, come out. There you go. You're in charge. The cop has just went up there questioning those children. The law is. You don't question children without an adult around. Yeah. So that's not oh, yeah. wrong. They ask them, oh, do you know this stuff? That's wrong. These are little children come to march. They march because they wear shirts of their grandfather, Country Matheson. He was a song dancer and a song man. That's wrong. You don't do that yeah, to little children. Black bag over there. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
I just come up here uh, to pay respects to the traditional owners of this land and uh, show them that.